Hi guys, my name is Brittany and today I'm going to do a tack haul. So I just want to talk about this a little bit first. Um, I'm, <laughs> I'm making this because I watch an embarrassing amount of tack hauls. Like that is all I watch on YouTube, which is a little sad and that's just where my life is at right now, okay? I have a broken leg and that's what I do all day. So I'm not doing this to brag at all, I just have a lot of horsey stuff. And I know I love watching tack calls because then I can go watch I can go watch them and then find out other things that I can buy because I'm a serious shopaholic and it's a serious problem and I don't know what to do with myself. And it's fine, it's okay, it's fine. But I bought all this with money that I got from selling all my old horse stuff. So it's justified, right? Yeah, I think it's justified. I think we're good. But yeah, please don't take this the wrong way. I'm just a loser who really likes watching tag hauls, so now I'm making one, so. This is the first thing I got. This is the Back on Track Ankle Brace, and I got this because I broke my leg a few months ago, and apparently it's supposed to help with stuff like broken legs, and I picked out my size and everything, and like I measured and all that kind of fun stuff to make sure I got the right one, and it cuts off my circulation. It gave me a huge bruise on the bottom of my foot. My physical therapist was like, um, you have to stop wearing that like right now. <laughs> so I did because it was literally cutting off my circulation in my whole foot. I think it was like $30 and apparently it's really good to help with like horses stuff because I hear people rave about it for like their horses. Like they have hawk wraps and uh, like fly sheets and all that kind of stuff. And they also do human stuff. And then it just, it's kind of hurt me a little bit and gave me a bruise. So that's not, it's not great. So, back on track what you doing because I measured and everything and my foot is actually smaller than what it used to be <laughs> like it's actually smaller than my actual foot size because it's all shriveled and gross so why what's happening I just don't I don't recommend it I'm sorry unless you want to size up and even then I don't know if it would not cut your circulation off and the next thing I got were these bad boys the carrot equestrian pants because they couldn't come up with a better name but they're like, basically they're made out of like the rain raincoat material and they're for wearing over your white breeches when you go and show. So they don't get dirty. And if you're clumsy like me, your pant, your white pants are brown by the time you get to the arena. So these are very helpful. They were $10 at my local tax store because they're freaking old. They're packed for $19.99. These little carrot seeds that come with the carrot bags. Yeah. Packed for $19.99. And they're this lovely plaid that just screams I'm going to a horse show 15 years ago. But yeah, they're cute, they're functional. They have little zippers on the bottom so that they can fit over your tall boots and stretchy waistband because everyone knows that you eat bad at horse shows. So there's room for some extra tummy in there. The next thing I got were these lovely full seat tan breeches from Dover. And they're the Riding Sport brand, which is just Dover's brand. And I thought they'd be really good for cross country because they're full seat. And as we can tell from my broken leg, I don't have a sticky butt. But these were only like $24 because they were having a big sale on a lot of their breeches. And I really was needing another pair of tan ones. But they're actually really nice. I wasn't expecting them to be nice. I was expecting them to be like the cheap ones, whatever. But they have soft bottoms. They do have like the, the thin belt loops. And I don't really like that as much, but I mean, they were $25, so. And from Dover, I also got these very stylish gloves. I mean, just look at these. They are absolutely perfect. If you want to stand out, like in the hunter ring, I think this would be ideal. I really do. Um, the judge would probably give you extra points just for having these gloves because they're just so cute and stylish, right? No, I'm just kidding about that. Please don't wear these in the hunter ring. I don't want you to get like disqualified because of me. I also don't ride hunters, so I wouldn't know. <laughs> These are the Noble Outfitters Perfect Fit Cool Mesh Glove. And when I was buying stuff from Dover, they had these and they were like $5. So I thought this would be really good for summer because I needed a new pair of gloves anyway. And even though they're kind of ugly and kind of cute at the same time, they're functional. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, for $5, you can't really complain about what color they are. They're my size and that's all that really matters. And the next thing I got, I actually left to the barn because I'm an idiot. But I'm just, I'm so excited about this pad because it is so pretty. It has really nice little sparkles. 
and I just I love it it's it's royal blue it is the horse Caesar dressage cut pad this quality on this is so good this top part is cotton and then underneath but it's like this black mesh underneath so I think it's gonna be really cool for like in the summertime and it's not super thick it's like the perfect thickness I feel like because it's not it's not too thick but it's not too thin it's nice and squishy it's got weather relief cut out like the cutout so it's shaped like that and it retails for $40 but horselovers.com had it for 25 and so when I saw it for 25 I was just like yes I need it because I'm like a raccoon just a little bit if I see something sparkly I must take it for myself and then I'm really really excited about this whole thing because what I got to go with it $15 on rhinestones and more on Facebook I got this gorgeous like dark blue and light blue and clear Cobb whoop de whoop brow band and it's just like it's really pretty and I will say the quality I was hoping it would be better I but I mean I got it for $15 so I can't really complain but one of the big gems already fell out I don't think it's gonna be be a big deal I think I can just go to the craft store and get something else and glue it in and it'll look fine but a few of the little rhinestones were loose and that made me really scared to use it but she actually has really, really pretty brow bands in a ton of different colors, and most of them are under $30. So I'll link her on Facebook. And I think the only reason mine was messed up is because it was on clearance. And she stated everything. Like, she said on the ad that, like, it's messed up. <laughs> but it's, I mean, it's totally fine. It looks really pretty. It's really shiny. It's, like, super shiny. And it matches my horse pad. Perfect. Okay, so this next thing is really cute. That just says Circuit Style, and that's because it's from Circuit Style Boutique. Uh, that's just seems like it's a given because it has this name on it, but <laughs> Circuit Style Boutique is like an Instagram shop one of those But it's so stinking cute and they sent me this with my order for free And I thought that was really nice because I like free things But what I actually paid for because I thought this was really cute, too This it's probably gonna show up really bright. Oh, it is Yeah, can you focus on my face and then you'll get it it's showing up really bright because it is really bright. It's light pink with sparkly letters. It just says breach body over beach body because we're equestrians and we'd rather look good in breeches than in bikinis. Yeah, that makes sense. Great. And it also has their cute little logo on the back, which is also not, please stop being so bright. But it's really cute and it was only $15 and they have like three styles total and they're only $15 each because they were on sale. I believe they're sold out, but I think they're gonna restock. But I'll link them down below anyway because they have really cute designs. There's another one that's like, these breeches fit before I ate all those fries, which I thought was really funny. Because I eat french fries, how relatable. <laughs> So the last thing I want to show you guys today are these C4 belts, which I think they're upside down. That's fine. <laughs> but if you don't know what C4 belts, what are you doing? How have you not heard of C4 belts? That's okay. That's fine. They are rubber belts that are actually fully adjustable because you can cut them to whatever size you want and then clip it on, clip on the belt buckle. That's really nice because I suck at buying things my size, so I can't screw this up unless I cut it too short, which is probably gonna happen, but it's fine. But they're really cute and they're really popular among equestrians, and they have really pretty like equestrian designs on them. The first one I got is navy with white dressage horses on it, and I think it's really pretty. I just, I don't know, I thought it was really pretty and I liked it a lot, and it was on sale, so I got it. And the next one, I'm so excited about this one because people have been telling me to get it for a while, and I finally did, because my cross country colors are red, white, and blue, and my horse is an OTTB. And this belt is a nice mixture of both of those things because how coincidental is it that you're gonna have a belt that's red, white, and blue and says OTTB on it? That's that's just, I had to, I had to get it. And it'll also go with the Royal Blue Saddle Pad which will also match the brow band which will also match, I don't know what else it'll match. That's fine. Anyway, that's all the stuff I bought this time. Oh wait, no there's not. And last but not least, even though I almost forgot about it, which how could I? Are you kidding me? I got this Pony App Pop Socket. I'm gonna take this little cover off. It's so cute. This is what it looks like. And Pop Sockets are another one of those have you been living under a rock things. But 
This is a pop socket with my pony's face on it. And it's not like an exact match. Obviously it's like a stripe and my horse has like a thing. But it's close enough for me to be happy. And this is from the Pony app. And if you haven't heard about the Pony app, I'll probably talk about this more later because I'm freaking obsessed with it. It's incredible. It's just a really cool app that's really good for like anyone who owns horses. That's all I have today. Uh, let me just reiterate again. I'm really not trying to brag. I'm sorry if this is making me sound like a conceited brat. Maybe I am. Maybe this is just my true personality coming out. I don't think it is though. Anyway, I hope you all have a great day and maybe you want to go buy some stuff because I'm enabling your addiction and then you can go out and make a tech video and then you can enable my addiction because I'll go watch your stuff and buy some more stuff and we'll just have a circle of enabling each other's tack buying addictions. Bye. <laughs>